What is going on ladies and gentlemen? We are back again with another update video on the Mohammed situation on whether he's going to get deported or not. But before we get into it, let's give a big massive shout out to every single person that is a member of the channel, that is a member of Patreon, and that is a subscriber as we continue to grow. Now we're gonna head over to Instagram real quick where we have where I've come across this post here by 90 Day Chisme. Now I must say though, this page itself in particular has been quite a very reliable source. I know they always drop in um, screenshots of conversation that they have or they come across. And to be honest with you, a lot of these Instagram pages that I do obviously use to um, help me give you guys information. I'm gonna lie to you, man. They do amazing work because honestly, um, I think it's been amazing that most of the time the information is actually correct. You never know if it's correct, but then it turns out being correct. So <laughs> I'm only saying that because in this one here, the screenshots are of the channel is still having a conversation with someone else who has the T. So of course, because of that, we can only say that this is all allegedly true, but I strongly do believe that it is true purely because um, usually um, this source is quite reliable with the information and rarely incorrect. But as you can see here, the conversation starts off by basically saying what's going on. Nothing really. I just came to drop T. Oh yeah, drop it. Mohammed is not getting deported. What? What? Really? Nope, he already filed for the green card, even though they, they divorced, he just has to wait uh, longer to become a naturalized citizen. Oh, that's interesting. They didn't find the marriage, uh, they didn't find that the marriage was fraudulent. What about the text messages? From what I was told, they found that Eve was creating in, 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 in inhumane living conditions. And also continues by saying, also, Eve has another man listed on her home. I mean, if she has, then I can imagine that's probably her baby father. But who knows? Who knows? But let's continue. Who is it? Well, supposedly it, it was her boyfriend. Another person, she said, um, it was, another person said she was secretly married. I don't know, but I know for sure they were bumping and grinding. Can you imagine this, ladies and gentlemen? Let's just go back to that one once again. Supposedly. It was her boyfriend, another person. She was secretly uh, married. So, well, is she married to another person as well? What is going on here? It's, it's becoming a little bit of a sticky one, isn't it, ladies and gentlemen? Um, but, hey, but, but of course, it does say they were definitely bumping and grinding. So it'll be interesting to see if we ever find out who this other person is. But also on top of that, um, continues by saying, so what all the fluff her, her lawyer is putting out? Her lawyer is an attention-seeking... <clears throat> <laughs> Tell me what lawyer you know um, that is to be taken seriously is posting TikTok videos about their client situation. Now, that is a strong fact because her lawyer said that this, the case had been closed, but then I made a video the other day confirming that the case was still open and literally she had a virtual hearing literally like days ago and she's due for another one soon. So, um, to be honest with you, I did find it quite interesting that Eve's lawyer was doing these TikTok videos. It made no sense whatsoever. But nonetheless, though, let's continue. Oh yeah, I love that, I guess so. What happens next? Mohammed and Eve are separated. Where is he staying with a friend? And then he continues on the next page by saying, court date. They said Eve charges were dropped. Not exactly put on hold for a law to, for a later court date, which is exactly what I made uh, previously. And also goes, okay, but where is Mohammed though? Um, like what state? Now, obviously that has not been answered. So clearly Mohammed, who knows uh, where he's at right now. But either way though, Somebody came in the comment section, maybe a few bit came in the comment section, my last video talking about how, no, the charges were dropped. And I was like, well, clearly they haven't because I'm showing you a video of evidence that the court, that, 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 that the, the trial is still going on or the pre-trial is still going on. Yeah. But um, either way, though, the situation is still ongoing at this moment in time. It has not finished at this moment in time. And right now it is looking based on this, that Mohammed is going to be getting a green card um, because obviously he's filed for it. And he will not be getting deported anytime soon, even if he does eventually get deported at some point, if that is going to be the situation. But right now, it is not looking good for, um, for Eve, to be honest with you, and it's looking great for Mohammed. But nonetheless, though, we shall see what happens next. And as always, I will keep you guys updated with all the information that I do come across, you know, obviously on my, uh, my, um, um, my, uh, I don't know, man. Nonetheless, though, thank you so much for your time. Make sure you like, you subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.